Hey there, folks. My name is Dazerin, and welcome back to The Walking Dead, Season 2, Episode 5. Let's talk to Jane and offer her some rum. Rum? Oh, man, I want some. I love rum. Rum and Coke is, like, the best. I love it. Come on. They expect you to lure me over there with alcohol? Yeah. I wouldn't have expected a bottle to last this long. Will it work? It depends. <laughs> what is it? Rum. It's rum? Probably. Come on. Yeah. Oh, I love rum. Rum, 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 and whiskey. Rum and whiskey. So, yeah, let's, uh, let's <laughs> hear about... Yeah, you want to talk about that? I don't... I don't know. It, it might be awkward. I wasn't expecting to... You know. Because you made it with Luke. It doesn't have to be. We're all adults here, are we now? Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean. Mature or whatever. I wish it was that easy. It is. People just love making it harder than it has to be. True. True dad. How does this feel like I'm signing a contract or something? Ah. That's really good. Yeah. Did you have any? Want to sip? Ooh, it's can okay. I? Oh, sure. Um, sure. Come on. Come on, Clem. Nope, guess not. <laughs> okay. Uh oh, busted. I better take that back. I wasn't Kenny. too much older than you when I had my first drink. God, I was so stupid back then. There was this time I broke into my parents' liquor cabinet and drank a whole bottle of this really spicy, sweet liquor. Oh, what was its name? I was dumb. Earthquake or something. Sounds like you were a bad <clears throat> kid. <laughs> I guess I was. At the bottom of the bottle, there were these sugar crystals. And I got it in my head that I really wanted to eat a couple. So I got the bright idea to smash it on my parents' dining room floor to get at them. But... And it shattered into a thousand pieces. Sounds like a mess. Yeah, it was. Every couple years, someone would step on a piece of glass that didn't get swept up and get mad at me all over again. The uh. problem with glass is it looks a lot like sugar crystals. Oh, it's geez, never don't. really been a problem for me. Keep it that way. <laughs> I was gonna say, did my you? Did you? Me, drunk, blood pouring out of my mouth. Yeah, she tried to eat the sh the the glass. They pumped my stomach. You ate glass. I ate glass. You kind of were stupid. <laughs> that's that's dumb. All right. No offense. That was dumb. I guess a deal's a deal. All yeah. right. Maybe Kenny will have some. I don't know. We'll see. That guy needs a drink more than any of us. Well, head on over, and I'll talk to Kenny. Time to not make it weird. All right, well then, do it. Just, just do it. Hi, everybody. How's it going? Want to sit here? No, that's. Uh, I'm fine. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. Wherever you like. All right. Let's go talk to. You. <laughs> Ooh, the smile. Hey, look at me. Oh, Arvo. Yeah. Let me talk to Kenny, and then I'll... Let me talk to Kenny, because I don't know if he's going to want... There, there, little guy. Shh. Shh, I got you. I got you. Hey. Oh, hey, Clem. Hey, how's it going? I'm starting to think she might be a bad influence on you. <laughs> Girl your age, it ain't right. Sorry about that. I didn't mean to disappoint you. You're not, hun. It's probably not my place to be telling you what to do. It's a nice night. Yes, it is. It's a nice, calm, quiet night with no Just walkers or any problems what whatsoever. Kenny, there's air everywhere. <laughs> After Sarita was, I just, I, I couldn't handle it. 
I'm sorry. I mean, you did what you could. You tried to help, and I blamed you for it. I'm so, so sorry. I... I could have done more. No, don't say that. You did everything you could. I'm sorry if anything I said made you feel any different than that. It just makes me feel awful. I know I can be a real shit sometimes. Stop. Just, no, just a it's bit. It's true. But I... I miss my boy. I miss him so much. I didn't raise him like I should have. Made mistakes. Wasn't there a whole lot for a couple years. Off on a boat somewhere or other. I thought I enjoyed that time away from him. From my family. But I'd give anything for one more second with them. To play catch with Doug. To touch Koch's face. Anything in the world. Maybe you'll see them again someday. Well, from here on out, I'm gonna try and believe that too. That better not be foreshadowing. It's gonna be different with him. He's gonna get raised right. I won't make the same mistakes again. That's a promise. You should get back over by the fire. So should you. Especially with the baby. Both of us being over here. I can handle watch on my own. You should come too. I don't know. Come on. It'll be good for everyone. Yeah, okay. All right. You do that. Good. Good. Baby's got to be warm anyway. All right. Well, let's uh a transformer and we're underneath it <laughs> I was gonna go talk to Arvo Jane, but I guess you don't not have to justify that with the response. Hey, I find it's best to just get this stuff out in the open less drama well that's fine but I can confirm there was no time for kissing <laughs> all right enough of that really hey you clam it's nice to hear people laughing yeah, it is. You just spend so much time trying to stay alive that you don't get a chance to enjoy living. Yeah, we need to make more time for that. Alcohol helps. Well, yeah. yeah. So yeah, what about Arvo? I was going to go talk to him. Let me get that bottle. We got someone else that might need some help. Sounds like a waste of good rum. Come on, lost Kenny. A sister today. And whose fault was that? That makes it even harder to deal with. Trust me. He needs it as much as anyone right now. It's a nice thing to do. I Come on, Kenny. Peace. Ah, Kenny. Come on, dude. I don't think that boy's a bad <clears throat> person. I just think good people do bad things sometimes. And they do it a lot more nowadays with the world being what it is. So I think it's best. Leave me alone! Okay then. I'm sorry, okay? My fault. I shouldn't have. Leave me alone! Okay then. Please, David. It's okay. It's okay. She's in a better place. It's okay. It's okay. Maybe it's best if we all get some rest. Who knows how long a walk we got tomorrow? Yeah, that's a good idea. Right. I'll take first watch. Again. Thank you, Kenny. Really? I, uh. Don't mention it. You did good. Uh, it was nice while it lasted. Yep. All right. <sighs> right of Frost. I don't know. Anyway. Moving onward. You sure you're good? 
Yeah, yeah, I'm good. If I, if I start to crap out, I'll let you know. Okay, okay. You can do that. There's no trouble. How much further? Close. Oh, come on, Get Kenny. Close. You've been saying that every time I ask. Please. Come. I'm really starting to think. Oh shit! Shit. Kenny, look out! What the fuck? No, 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 no. Jesus Christ! Are you okay? That was close. Fucker came out of nowhere. That was real loud. Hopefully there aren't more of them. Yeah, well, let's move. We don't want to be around to find out. It's very close. Come. Kenny, you're not having, you're not dealing with the least situation now, are you? I hope not. I really hope not. There. That piece of shit? It's half built. Well. We're here for the supplies, not the house. It's warm. Fireplace. Very warm. As long as there's food, who cares what it looks like? You're not gonna think that when you wake up with a couple inches of snow covering you. Are we just gonna walk over? <clears throat> yeah, I guess. Oh, ice. Maybe there's a way around. I don't see any. Say it in an American asshole. <laughs> it's okay. Walk. Ice. No shit ice. That's the problem. He's saying it's fine. I go first. I can be front. Maybe we shouldn't clump together. We just can't have too much weight. She's right. One we at a time. We need to spread out, just to be safe. Less weight, the better. One at a time. How about just Let one at a time? Let go first, since he's so confident. It's okay. Okay. <clears throat> this ought to be interesting. Oh boy. Alright, here we go. Yep, all the like slight... Oh god, this is gonna be... Oh, this is tense. This is tense and absolutely unnecessary. Oh, jeez. Okay. Okay. Uh, they're gonna make this... Oh, they're gonna draw this out, aren't they? Yep. Just gonna draw it out real slow. Oh. Ah. We're okay. Don't worry. And no. Oh, walkers. Uh-oh. That's not good. We got You'd think they'd be ice. sliding and slipping on the ice because they wouldn't. Be all right. Let's just get to the house. How on earth are they walking? Hey, stay with us. Fuck. Well, two of them. It was two of them, so. That's two less to deal with. We'll just stay spread out and we'll be fine. Hey! Motherfucker! Shit! He's gonna kill him! Uh, Kenny! Get back here, you piece of shit! I should let you drown, you piece of shit! No! Kenny! Don't run! Don't? Okay. Alright. Okay. Alright. Everybody else, keep moving. Keep moving. All right, let's do this. Let's keep well, moving. They made it. All right, Clem, come on, let's go. Oh shit. Oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. Okay. Don't come over here. Hey, I can make it. It's it's fine. Take sure? small yeah. steps. You got walkers on the way. Let me help you. No, 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 no. <laughs> Gotta be careful! Oh, no, no! Stop! 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 How did I'm you not fine. slip? I'm fine! No, you're not! I just gotta pull myself out! You need help, Luke! The ice is too thin! I got it! You need to help! No! Clem, go! Go help no, him! No, Clem, Clem, do not! Just go back for him! You're light! Yeah, no, I know, I, I don't weigh as much. Clem, look at me! Pull out your gun and shoot those damn walkers, okay? Just give me a little time. Clem, you okay. Can, but you need to go. No. Now. Clem, it's too dangerous. He's gonna yeah, die. Need some more okay, I'll cover. Thanks. Thanks. I'll be out in a sec. Just Let's... keep shooting. Okay, you, I, I trust you. Hold on, I can 
Dad, rest a sec. Okay. Uh, keep him off us, no, no, it's too much. Too Shut much up. Weight. Shut the fuck up. Go back. No, 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 no. Don't. You. Don't you do that. Come on. Stop. I got you. No. Oh, no. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Okay. Luke. That's... Come on. Clementine, stop! Nothing more you can do! Come on. Come on. CPR, we could do it. Really? Fuck. It's okay, I got you. No. I got you. Come on, come on. Come on, you're gonna be okay. Go to the house. We need a fire. Oh, fuck, she's gonna fucking freeze to death. Damn it. Oh, <sighs> well, there goes one. Did that happen? There's a Is there wood? Christ. We have to get them warm. They're gonna freeze to death. Come on. He's just gone. Looks fucking gone. We should have gone around. God damn it. We should have just fucking gone around. God damn it. It happened too fast. I said I started to go. There was nothing any of us could do. Did what I could. You could have helped him. Don't listen to her, Clem. This ain't on you. You son of a bitch! This is your fucking fault! Kenny! Don't, man! Don't what? It's nobody's damn fault. The hell it ain't! I'm freezing. Can we just get a fire started? Please. I'd appreciate it. Look at this place. Just a stack of fucking toothpicks. Bet those magical supplies are bullshit too. What? No speaking of English? Fuck you. You Ooh. fucking call me piece of shit. Really? Oh god. Fuck you. Oh boy. You mother. What the fuck, Kenny? Kenny, stop it! Please, can we focus on? Just stop. Can we focus on the the important things? You know, like hypothermia. What? Lose your taste for this sort of thing? Oh. That's not what it did at you all. Do to him? There's another just like it. He wasn't lying. Fire, heat. You want to tell me how a can of fucking chili is going to help? How is baby? beating a kid to death going to help anyone? This is your fault, and you damn well know it. What? I'm no, I what? Why would I no? I'm tying him up. Fine. Mike, help me get a fire started. You okay? He's hurt real bad. Mike. Okay, well. Yeah, okay. <clears throat> you got a light? I thought I had matches. Yeah, of course I did. Why wouldn't I? Jeez, she's like pale white. My goodness. There we go. Sit there and just warm up.
I am kind of getting tired of the things with Arvo because it feels like yeah, every night I, like. Let me it, take a look at you, kid. Me? Jesus. He could have killed you. The fuck is wrong with him? You're up. Yeah, I'm up. Kenny's out back trying to get some stupid truck started. What? I have a bad feeling. Something. I have a bad feeling about that okay? one. Thank you. Why? Uh, what's? I can't believe he's gone. I've lost people before, but it just hasn't felt this this shitty in a while. He was a great guy. God damn it. I shouldn't have come back. Oh, don't you don't start with that. I knew this would happen. I knew it. Well, I'm glad you did. Otherwise, I'd be drowning right now. I'd probably be dead I'm actually. Find clean that up. I can't take this shit anymore. Feeling better? Yeah. Hell of a day. Can we Gotta talk? If you're feeling up to it, I could use a hand out back with this truck. This sure. This house ain't worth the crap, but the vehicles ain't in bad shape. With a little luck, we can get one fixed up. Be out of here by nightfall. Yeah, sure, Kenny. That's the spirit, darling. I'll wait for you out back. I'll watch him. I say being awfully quiet. Why? Why? What? Uh, okay. Anyway. Clem. What? Just be careful. Oh boy. Kenny, 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 Kenny. Kenny, Kenny, Kenny. Well, it looks like it's in good shape. What That's did good. she have to say? I know she was running her mouth. What did she say? Well, we didn't talk about you. Really? Really, Kenny. over but AJ needs us now we gotta stick together on this thing all right I just don't want people Come on. let's see if the truck's gonna go all right let's do it hey just like the old days with the RV my daddy always had a half dozen wrecks he was fixing up he was a mean son bitch but he taught me respect girl like Jane could learn a thing or two about that. I like her. Just give her some time. Maybe you're right. Hell, I didn't know what to make of Lee at first. There you go. Of course, he helped me in mine more times than I can remember. Well, there you go, Jane see? helped us back on the road. All right, give it a turn. All right, let's do it. Wah! Nothing. We're so close, Clem. With a little bit of luck, I can get this thing running, and then we can get out on the road and really make some distance. Wellington's got to be out there. Now, those rumors can't all be bunk. I mean, hell, there's got to be something out here other than... Snow and goddamn Euro trash. Sounds good to me. We're gonna make it, Clem. I know it. You're getting a little idealistic. Right, turn it again. I don't know about that. Did you turn it? Yes. God damn it! Come on, Kenny. Don't. <sighs> don't lose it. Kenny, are you okay? We gotta get moving if we're gonna keep AJ alive. We're running out of time. 
I'm hey, that's the name of the episode. Start. Gonna try warming up the battery. Go on inside. I don't like leaving him with that girl. Okay then. Oh, that's a cool angle. I like that. Okay, well, let's go. Excavator. Why would I why would I look at an excavator? I don't know. Hey Bonnie. What's going on? How you doing? Why are you out here? I didn't see you there before. Smoking, huh? What do you want? Whoa. I'm sorry about Luke. Sorry. It must be nice being a pretty little girl. No one ever expects you to do a damn thing. What? You and I both know you had a chance to save Luke. Oh, God. You and I both know what happened back there. The ice I was too thin. I more to say to you. Alrighty, then. Ah. <sighs> didn't make any sense when he could just pull himself out. He said he said he could pull himself out. If he did fall, then sure, but what? Hey. Where where's oh, okay. Mike and Arvo wouldn't shut up, so I moved him in here. God damn it. <sighs> Seen that look before. Son of a bitch. I've seen it too. A few times. Then you know what's about to happen. What? Oh boy. I know Kenny's a nice guy, Clem. I bet Carver was a nice guy too. Once. Are we Probably really a nice comparing job, him? A nice pretty wife. Then all this happened. And one comparing day he both of them some together? Jason and realized he could sleep at night. <sighs> Kenny isn't Carver. He just made a mistake. All I'm saying is, start thinking about what happens if you're wrong. Okay. I really... I don't... Like we've known each other a long time. Yeah. Sooner or later, you're gonna have to decide how much that's worth. Oh, boy. I think it needs food or something. <laughs> it... You're not very good with kids, huh? Or just me. Seems like you've done that before. You wanna try? No way. Let's <laughs> you. Clem, no. <laughs> Hold it like this. Hey. Hi. <laughs> My name's Jane. I think it's gonna puke. It's not gonna puke. <laughs> it puked. It puked. Gross. Coming from the lady who pours guts and stuff all over her. There's not much left. I was running with some people a long time ago, down near DC. Some guy got trapped in the middle of a crosswalk. Can't remember his name. He used to call me Mary Jane. He was a douchebag. Anyway, the dick got stuck under a car hiding from a dozen walkers. One after another, they went down there trying to save him. They all died? We lost four people before yeah. we got him out. Oh, okay. So he made it? Didn't find out till later he was already bit. Turn and rip the neck right out of this old lady. The look on her face was... She was just staring up at the sky. Like she was watching a bird. Kenny is getting that truck look, much closer. Oh, there it goes. He got it working. Holy crap. Works? What I tell you? 
So what's the plan? How much food do we have? At least a week. And for the baby? We need to find a place for the baby. Yeah, someplace warm. I agree. We should head back south. What? We're gonna freeze to death. I don't know whose stupid idea it was to march up here in the first place, but it was a bad one. She's right. What if we went back to house? Wait, what? Fuck that. I was thinking more like Texas. Texas? The fuck? It was just an idea. We already talked about this. I'm sorry. We did? We're going to find Wellington. Right, Clem? Wellington? Oh, God. Kenny, it's freezing up here, man. It's only gonna get worse. We came this far. We're not going back. Nah, man. This is fucking nuts. We don't have to leave right now. Let's just sleep on it. Oh, God. Kenny's gonna be upset. Well, that sounds sensible. Damn Kenny's it, gonna be upset. Oh, jeez. Says you. Look, I don't give two shits about what you people think. I got this truck working, so I say where we go. And we're heading fucking north. It's the best chance we got of helping AJ. What about Arvo? Who? Oh, the Rusky? Yeah, he ain't coming with us. You're just gonna leave him here? I don't give a good goddamn where he goes. He's done. He could die. We should ask him what he wants. There's a concept. He knows the area. He can help us. Oh, yeah, some help he's been. He got Luke killed. I ain't gonna say he helped the situation, but maybe if you'd eased up on him before, he wouldn't have run away in the first place. You ever think about that, Kenny? Oh, Either God. way, I'm not going anywhere in the middle of the night. Yeah, me neither. There could be a herd out there. You want that child's blood on your hands, Mike? We're all gonna die out here if you don't calm the fuck down, Kenny. Haven't we been through enough for one day? Jesus fucking Christ. Remember the last time we had a working car and sat around on our asses, Clem? Uh... I'm trying to remember. God damn it! Kenny, are you okay? No, I'm not okay. Alright, let's have a talk. No, no, we're gonna have a talk. You better talk some sense into him. Yeah, we're gonna have a talk. For his sake. Let's do this. Get in the passenger side. Get in that passenger seat and let's talk. God damn it! God damn it! That stupid fucking... Get the fuck out of here! It's no. me! Clem! Sorry, just... Give me a second. What are you doing? Close the door. Can you believe this, Clem? I okay. Bring them a working okay. Truck, okay. And they act like I just shit in their cereal. I knew Jane would have a stick up her ass, but I thought at least Mike would have more sense. He's turned out to be a real disappointment. Why? Why can't we just leave tomorrow? Look, we got maybe a day's worth of food for that kid left. That's it. Clem, think about Rebecca and Alvin. I mean, what if Lee hadn't gone tearing across half of Georgia looking for you? A lot of folks died to make that happen. A lot of folks died to get us this far. Maybe he shouldn't have. Don't you say that. I ought to slap you. What? You know what he sacrificed for you? What I did? That means something, damn it! Lee was here. Me too. What you think he'd say? I think he'd tell me that he doesn't have all the answers. And that we should keep moving. I think you're right. We can't just give up on this kid. I mean, what's the point of going on after that? That's what people like Lee knew. And what people like Jane won't ever understand. Look, I know Wellington might be bullshit, but where there's smoke, there's fire. Krista heard about it too, right? She did. You know, she did mention it. When I first saw you back at that lodge, I thought I was dreaming. And when you sat down next to me and we shared that meal, well, I could tell that you were different now, grown up. I felt pride, a pride I hadn't felt in a long time. But I need you now, Clem. 
There have to be folks doing better than us. Yeah, but we can't do it alone. We need the others. And that's why I gotta be able to count on you, Clem. We gotta convince him. You and me. We're not gonna do it by yelling we'll at them. everything out in the morning. Okay. Come on. Let's get some sleep. So there you go. Ready. Well, at least he's gonna sleep and wait till morning. I got him that far. Then we'll see how much we can figure out from there. <sighs> oh boy, this episode's running a little over. We're gonna end it there. So thank you all so much for watching. You guys will make this channel happen, and I thank you very much for that. And I will catch you in the next video. Uh.